My name is Alan Hart and today I'm doing Day in the Life of a Plumber. Um, today's, today is going to be an underfloor heating uh, video. So this video I'm going to do a step-by-step -step series of how to install underfloor heating. This is in my own house. Um, I fitted underfloor heating in my man cave and I used I used an overlay system in the man cave um, which it raises the floor a little bit but in this system I want to put I don't want to raise the floor at all so I'm going to take all the floorboards up and I'm going to put insulation down I'm going to put underfloor heating in and then we're going to put floor back down I'll do a full step-by-step -step video if you've got any questions at all if you can ask them in this video now and as I do the videos as I do the series of videos I'll try my best to answer all the questions I'm also going to show you how to connect into the existing heating system we'll remove the radiators and and we'll put zone valves in and, and we'll totally do the job from start to finish so first of all we'll I'll show you the floor that we've got and then we'll do a drawing and, and I'll show you how to get the right size system that you need so let's have a look now so to understand the system that we've got the hallway downstairs and then this is the lounge this is these carpets have been inherited <laughs> they're not going to be staying once we've uh, done all this if you have a look at my walls and stuff they're all a mess at the minute we've got timber floor we've got a timber floor there I've just got Dave here from Beneath Heat. He's just doing some drawing. He's uh, measuring all up for me, and he's going to get me um, get it all sized correctly for me. We've got the kitchen floor in here. We've got laminate floor in here. All this laminate floor is going to come up, and then in here, at the moment, we've got a fridge freezer, and I'm going to put the underfloor heating in here. I'm going to connect it onto the boiler which is behind there. This is the system I've got at the moment. I've got a combi boiler. That's a Baxi combi boiler and it's on an S plan at the moment. And this one zone controls downstairs and one zone controls upstairs. So what we'll do is we will cut out the downstairs circuit and we'll make all the downstairs into underfloor heating. And we'll put a manifold somewhere, maybe on this wall here. Um, might have to be on this side. We'll have to just see. It depends on. I still want to put the fridge back in here afterwards. So Dave's just putting a scale, uh, a drawing together for us here. It would be best, if possible, to use architects' drawings. Um, but what what will happen with this drawing is once this has been done, this will get sent off to the office to to beneath heat, and they will produce some plans. And then that will tell us exactly what we need for this system. Just show you the type of floor that we've got. So we've got floorboards, and then underneath the floorboards, we've we've got a little bit of a void. So what we'll do, we'll put some timbers on here, and then we'll put some insulation under, and then we'll put spreader plates, and then we'll have us MLCP underfloor heating pipes as well so the system that we're going to use is um, Dave's just there just uh, measuring up and putting out measurements in the system we're going to use is this one so it's the plate the plate system there's lots of different types of systems for different situations but as I say on this particular job I'm going to use the plate system Dave's done all the drawing for us now. That's going to be forwarded on to the Beneath Heat office. Beneath Heat will then do a detailed plan, a detailed drawing. And um, what I'll do is I'll just nip out to the garage because I actually got one um, from a previous installation. I'll just show you that. Once it's been sent off to the office, they will produce a drawing like this, tell us all as flow rates, as temperatures, tells us all as sizes, as loops, what centers we need to do. So it's a very detailed 
very detailed drawing. They also send a pack, manifold pack, which tells you different types of systems, wiring, etc., and a how to guide. So, this is the how to guide. It actually comes with a few different guides, really. Um, there's, a, um, there's a technical one as well. There's a technical product guide, and that tells you all sorts of different floor structures and um, measurements and stuff like that. And then there's a installation guide as well, which comes with it. And that, that shows you everything from how to cut the pipe, um, all different stuff, how high to put your manifold. It's really good, to be honest. Uh, but what I'll do is, as as we're doing this series of videos, I'll, I'll I'll go through I'll go through the different different parts of it. So please, please, if you could add some comments below. And as I say, what I'll try and do is I'll try and add as much. I'll answer as many of the questions as I can. Thanks for watching.